Hello all, so I wanted to discuss with you all whether or not it is a good decision to get a doctorate in school psychology. Now, there are two different types of doctorates that you could get uh, primarily uh, for psychology, and that is a PsyD or a PhD. As I discussed in previous videos, a PsyD is a practitioner doctorate and a PhD is more of a research doctorate. So, is it a good idea to get a doctorate period in school psychology? And I say, yes, it is definitely a good idea. Uh, some people want a doctorate simply because they want to be called doctor. And if you want that as your, if you want to be able to be called doctor and you want to have your doctorate and it's a sense of accomplishment, I say, hey, go for it. Now, it is expensive. Uh, you know, as you know, education is expensive. So is it going to be worth it just to be called doctorate? You'll have to weigh out that for yourself. However, if you already have, you know, a couple of master's degrees and you don't want to get another master's degree in school psychology or if you say well if I might as well get the doctorate you know over the specialist degree then I say go ahead and get it you know some people they go ahead and just get the specialist degree which is in between a master's and a doctorate some people say you know that's all I want that's all I need in order to get my my license and so they go ahead and just stop at the specialist I say that a doctorate is only about 30 more hours than a master's or a specialist degree so you know it's it's probably going to be a couple of more semesters I would say that if you if you if your school offers a specialist degree and they offer a doctorate degree I'd say hey just go ahead and get the doctorate you'll probably earn another master's on route to the doctorate anyway you know from for instance my program they have a master's degree and there is the doctorate degree since I do have a couple of master's degrees I thought well why not just go ahead and get the doctorate because I don't want to just do another 60 hours and then have just another master's degree. I said, why don't I just go ahead and do the 32 extra hours that I need to do and go ahead and get the doctorate. You, you see what I'm saying? And I'm earning, really, I'm earning my a master's degree too. I'll, I'll graduate with my master's in, in educational psychology at the end of this year. So I said, you know, why not go ahead and just do the doctorate program? Now, it is a lot, it is, like I said, a PhD is research. You're going to be engaged in a lot of research. You're going to be probably doing uh, research projects with your professors. Uh, for instance, I have, what well, we, we have 7,000 level courses and we have to do a research project with one of the professors that we choose, one of the professors that probably has research uh, that is an interest in my interest field so I'll be doing that then you're going to be doing research just in some of your course courses and then you're obviously going to be doing your dissertation so it is a lot of research if you do not like research then just go ahead and get the specialist or get the the master's degree and then you don't have to do all of that research and you don't have to put the 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 dissertation together and all of that but if you don't mind doing that and you say, hey, you know what, I would also like to teach at the college or university level, then the doctorate would be great for you. Um, it, it will open you up to working in academia. If you want to, say, just do research only and you don't want to work in schools as a school psychologist, then you can actually go ahead and get a PhD in educational psychology, uh, which will provide you with all of the tools that you need to be a researcher, a professor, you could write grants and you can do things like that. Uh, but if you do want to be a practitioner, if you do want to be able to work in schools, uh, you know, you, you do the school psychology or an educational psychology PhD with a specialization in school psychology. Now, there are many things that you have to consider when getting a doctorate degree besides just the research. Like I mentioned previously, the cost. You're gonna be have to pay. You're gonna have to pay for those extra extra couple of semesters if you decide to get the doctorate. You know you're gonna have to uh, 
you know, really discuss with your advisor or someone at the school whether or not it's going to be worth it. I'm a research assistant, so it takes a lot of the tuition off, uh, you know, for of my coursework. So, you know, it, I only have to pay a fraction of what I would have to pay if I was not a research assistant. So look into those options when you are thinking about getting into a doctorate. Look at, at teaching assistantships. Look at research assistantships. Uh, look at all of the scholarships that are available. Look at even if there are any grants in your state that are going to provide you with uh, monies to go to school. So just really think about those sorts of things in you know when you are deciding whether or not you should go and get a doctorate or a specialist or a master's degree i know a lot of people are getting their specialist degrees and that is awesome you know like i said it's above a master's and it's right below a a a phd degree so you know i think it all around it is worth it i say that if you at the end of the day can push through and do those extra couple of semesters go ahead and do it you know and if you're doing it at the same school that you earned a master's degree at and stuff then you may already be familiar with a lot of your professors and stuff and they can really kind of help guide you through that master's uh, I'm sorry that doctorate program also if you are thinking about getting into a doctorate program really um, use your your classmates as a resource because they really can help you out and you can really help them out so is getting a doctorate worth it yes it is but definitely consider all your options before you plunge in you know it is overwhelming sometimes but yes it is worth it so i hope you all enjoyed this video i will be back soon with more videos thank you